Well, hello, I'm Richard Collins. I'm one of the technology analysts at ID Tech X, and we're here at the ID Tech X show in Santa Clara, USA. I'm joined by the president of Haydell, Ray Gibbs, who's going to be making a very exciting market announcement later on today. So just to start, Ray, can you tell us a little bit about Haydell? Yes, I can. Um, we're a small business, um, 75 staff, geographically spread um, in advanced materials, actually, graphene and silicon carbide. Um, our main markets are composites, elastomers, uh, nitrile rubber to you and me, uh, and inks and coatings. So that's our, that's our main focus and what we do. Uh, we're in uh, America, we're in uh, Thailand, Taiwan and Korea, and in the United Kingdom. Oh, fantastic. So tell us more about your graphene work and how this is going to be leading into the market launch later. Uh, okay, so we don't actually um, make the graphenes that are used in the market. We will buy from the market and see which is the most appropriate to uh, put into a, an ink, a coating or, or a composite material. Um, and we, we use a patented process that plasma treats uh, the material and adds chemical groups to the ends and the surface. Which is, a definite, which is a means of actually then allowing um, homogeneous dispersion. Because when, when you disperse it properly, you get all these fantastic properties that graphene is, is vaunted to have. Absolutely, it prevents the agglomeration and much more use. Correct, if you agglomerate it, you get lumps and, and, it's a, and you just won't, it just won't perform at all. So you, 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 need, you need to disperse it totally. And you only need to use very, very small some, um, amounts of, of this material. Less than 1% often is, is good enough. Fantastic, to make use of most of the properties. Correct. So what about later? What are you going to be introducing to the market? Okay, so we've, uh, I'm about to go and sign um, a licensing agreement with a high security uh, printer in Thailand called TKS. Uh, and they're a quoted company as well in Thailand. And they want to license our anti-counterfeiting product, which we've just developed and, and is now, we're now commercializing. Um, if you want me to tell you about how it works, I can. Absolutely, please okay. tell us the okay. technology okay. behind okay. it. <laughs> so we're using graphene to print um, on, a, on a substrate initially, a series of dots and, and, and spaces. And, um, and what we do is we then read the capacitance reading that that gives us. Okay. So what we then do is we will take a series of readings and we give a measurement. And through the, the secure server, we'll we, we can then download it onto an app, any app on any smartphone, Android, iPad, iPhone, anything that's, that's, that's read by touch. Um, and then that, that is then locked into the smart reader. We'll then print onto a, on, onto a, um, a product, be it a cigarette packet, um, uh, a bag, or, or s some alcohol, or anything that is prone to being counterfeiting, which is like um, pharmaceutical. So you, pu you print it onto the, 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 the product. When you touch the, the phone, oh it actually reads the capacitance that you've printed onto the, the product. If it measures the same as what it's been programmed to receive, it will give you a, 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 a tick in the box, if you like, and say, this is a bona fide product. If it doesn't, it will tell you you've got a bogus, bogus material. Mm -hmm. So for those in the industry, it's a $200 billion market. Well, not into the market, it is actually a, a big issue. Many, many products are counterfeited. Um, and the tobacco industry, the pharmaceuticals in particular, they want to stamp this out because it's damaging, A, damaging reputation, but B, they're losing sales. Sure. And so why graphene over any other conductive material? Okay, gra gra ink? graphene, graphene um, has fantastic properties if you, if you mix it properly. What, it, what we're doing is we're seeing brilliant first layer adhesion on, okay. onto the surface. Um, there's a measure called the CV ratio, which is the coefficient of variation, which is the standard deviation divided by the mean. And the lower that percentage is, the more consistent the product is. And our CV ratio is 0.4 of 1%. Wow. So we are really, really, really consistent. And, and that's graphene giving us that consistency of, of a print, uh, in a print pro program, print media. Mm. And you spoke about the large addressable market and a variety of these products. So what's gonna be your route to market? Okay, <clears throat> so first of all, we want somebody to actually take this product on and use it in their own business. So TKS, high security printer, uh, second largest company in, the, in their field in Thailand. Um, they have a range of products and they want to use this to actually embellish and help their sales in, in Thailand and the surrounding countries. So the route to market is license the technology, 
Um, they can then download the app for their own customers if they want to, and we will sell them the ink. So our route to market is a license fee, um, a royalty stream, and then we sell the ink because the ink is proprietary to us. It's our formulation. It can be made for any customer, bespoke cu to customers, but it's the ink that we want to sell. A bit like the Hewlett Packard uh, route to market that they do. They, they, they're not interested in selling, well, they are interested in selling uh, computers and printers, but they really are all about selling you the ink. Absolutely, the material side, the vendor lock-in system. It's the Gillette uh, shaver, shaver principle, and we're no different to that. Mm. So how quickly might this happen? How quickly might we see these in products? In, well, uh, today, today we're going to sign, sign up TKS. Um, I'm going to announce it at the ID Tech X show, um, and we are in the process already of proving the principle with them. We've got a little project working with them to f create the first one. So within two or three months, I'm expecting to see things happening. Ah, oh, fantastic. No, it sounds very exciting. Okay. As Ray said, he's going to be speaking in just a little while at the ID Tech X show. And how have you been finding the show? It's busy. Um, it's grown. Uh, we were talking earlier that saying um, it's, uh, it, it's grown from small beginnings to something now which is, you know, attracts an awful lot. Printed electronics and media is, is really a high-end uh, application for any, many materials. But here, um, uh, yesterday was very, very busy indeed. It was excellent, really, and a lot of people, a lot of footfall. Ah, fantastic. So it's good marketing for you guys, yeah? Absolutely. Well, thank you very much for your time, Ray. I'm That's really okay, looking Richard. forward to your presentation okay. a bit and looking forward to seeing the product in the market. Yeah, me too. Thank you very <laughs> thank much. Thank you. Bye.